Hey, how's it going? Uh, so today I wanted to go over the Magpul Docker pouches that I own here. Uh, some of these I've owned for a few years, which is going to be these here. These I picked up as soon as the Docker pouches were released from Magpul, so they're pretty old, um, but they still look in pretty great condition. Um, I actually have two more of these. Uh, one of them's uh, like a dedicated uh, medical kit that's inside of my wife's car, and then I have another one of these. Same, they're all mediums. Um, the other one is in like a safe that has all my important documents. So I keep all that stuff in one of these. Um, and then all these other ones here I purchased pretty recently, a few months back. Uh, and I've been loving these specifically here. Like these things are awesome. So I was like, you know what? Uh, the main reason behind this video is because I was out on the range a few days ago and I was using these. Um, and I was like, man, I gotta make a video of this. I know there's a bunch on YouTube, but I feel like I should just give my input and why I like them. I mean, I'm not sponsored or anything by them, so I feel like, you know, it's not biased. Uh, but yeah, these here are the Magpul volume pouches. Um, I picked these up to throw like mags and stuff in them and I had all these other different ideas to use these for, but when they came in and I kind of saw my ammo lying around, I was like, you know what? These will be perfect little ammo pouches. Um, so I went ahead and did a 5.56, 45 and nine mil, which is what I mainly shoot. Um, and yeah, they were awesome. Like I was saying a few days ago, I was at the range and, you know, I was at the 50 yard line. Then I wanted to move up to the 10 yard line to shoot pistol, uh, but there's no tables or anything on the floor. So I had to carry everything to the 10 yard line. So instead of doing that, I just went ahead and grabbed my, um, Magpul volume pouch. It has my ammo. I carried my, uh, SIG P320 and two mags. So I was good to go. I just walked it up to the 10 yard line. Um, and you know, threw it on the ground and I was just reloading from the ground there and it was fine. Uh, same thing with the 45. I have some mags and then two mags, uh, two mags and some ammo in there. Um, I couldn't throw in my FNX 45 cause it was too big, but I mean, I just carried this in my FNX or these two in my FNX and to the 10 yard and I was good. Uh, so yeah, these here are pretty awesome. You can fit like 30 rounders in here, you know, all kinds of stuff. It doesn't have to be firearms related. You, you could really throw a bigger medical kit in there if you want to like there's all this stuff you can use these for but this is just how i use mine so again these here um, are some of the newer pouches that i picked up from magpul uh, this is going to be a small so i guess i'll go over the size comparison here this is the small here um, this is going to be the medium and as you can see i mean they're they're pretty it's a pretty bigger pouch when you start stepping up in sizes um, but it's nice. Like I really like these small ones. I use them a little bit more than any of any other size here. Uh, but yeah, this is the medium, and then we have a large. And then throw this one here so you can see the different sizes. And there it is. That's the large. Um, the large one is cool. I was using it for a while to throw in like paper targets folded in half, and then my stapler and stuff. But then I kind of didn't need it. I was like, man, I, I could just throw this on, like on the side pouch in my bag and I'll be good to go so I just, just leave this one empty and I'm going to be using it for some cable management for some other stuff that I got coming in but yeah that's the large this medium here is pretty dope too it fits a bunch of stuff I actually brought out some stuff to show you but I mean you can really throw in like a lotion and like a headlamp and you know they're they're pretty they're pretty deep like you can really fit a whole bunch of stuff in there and just toss it in your bag, toss it under the seat of your vehicle and, and it should be fine. So, and not only that, but these things are um, water resistant, not necessarily waterproof, but this seam here is pretty tight. So water would have a hard time getting in. Obviously if you submerge it, it'll be a different story, but yeah. Um, also this material here is really durable. These here are like a few years old and I've tossed them around, especially this one with my lithium batteries. Um, I've taught this, this one around the dirt and stuff and I just kind of wipe it down and it looks brand new still. Um, I haven't found any Amazon copies or eBay Chinese versions of these pouches that has this type of material. Like, I don't know if Magpul has it patent or something, but yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty dope. Like usually when you buy something there's always like a Chinese version of it that's like half the price. Um, and I tried, I really tried to go on Amazon and look for it, but everything was like felt or um some type of fabric and obviously that's not what you want that's at least not for me so yeah if you know of any like copies with this like plasticky material 
um, let me know because I'm curious to see how it stands up against like something like this because this is kind of pricey, right? Um, compared to something that would be like made in China and like half the price. So very curious about that. Uh, but yeah, these things are pretty dope. Um, I also, they also come in a few different colors. Um, if you go on their website, you'll be able to see the different colors that MacBow has for their pouches. Um, this one here is an orange one and I use it for my audio stuff for my camera. So I keep like my wireless mic, my lav mic, and then an audio recorder here. Um, I'm using the wireless mics now, so they're not in here, but everything fits fine. I also have this yellow one here that I use for all my lighting stuff, all my like wireless lighting. Um, so a bunch of little um, wireless lights here. They have a integrated battery and you can just throw them and pretty much light up any little spot. And these are pretty cool, but yeah, I keep them in this one here. Um, again, water resistant. So especially for these lights, they're kind of pricey. So I kind of want to keep them a little bit protected and all together so that I know where they are instead of just throwing them in my bag. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, I kind of just wanted to show you like they, they exist because there's always a few people that when I show something, they're like, what is that? Um, so for the one or two people that are going to ask me what our dock pouch is, <laughs> this is what this is what they are. Um, pretty nice little pouches that you can use for all kinds of stuff. Again, it doesn't have to be, I know Mac is a firearms category brand, but you don't really have to use it for anything related to firearms. I actually use this small one here for like my receipts so that when I need to like, kind of like hang on to my receipts for like accounting and stuff, everything is here. And this one actually lives in my car in the center console. So it has all the receipts in there. Um, these in my camera bag, these are in my safe. Um, these are technically all over the place, um, except for this deposit bag. And then, yeah, these two are kind of extra. I'm kind of messing around with different uh, setups for this. I want to build a bigger medical kit with this large one here since it is clear and you can see what's inside. So that's pretty dope. Uh, and yeah, that's going to be it. I just kind of want to show you. I'll link a bunch of the bags that I have down below. That way you guys can check it out if you want to. Um, Macpool always has like little sales here and there. Um, for example, these here I got for a pretty good deal. I didn't pay retail for these. They had a sale and I picked some up. Uh, I have actually two more orange ones and one more yellow one coming in that I purchased from like a sale that they had. Um, and I'm going to be using those for another project that I have coming up. But yeah, that's it. Just want to show you guys the Magpul Daca pouches.